Kate Douglas. I am president here at SUNY Corning Community College, and we are excited to be here today with my colleague. Jim Frame, uh, District Superintendent of Greater Southern Tier Policies. We're excited because the trustees of the Corning Community College last night passed a resolution that allows for the first time the program that we have been working together 45 years between the college and the local high schools, our Accelerated College Education, or ACE program, will now be able to be offered tuition free. We're very excited about that because, um, you know, there's a movement to make community college education free and it's expanding here in New York and we're part of that expansion. We work with over 40, 40 different schools here in the southern tier of New York and the northern tier of Pennsylvania. We deliver over 60 different college courses, and now for the first time, we can offer those tuition free. So for the high school students in our region, specifically the 21 component districts of Greater Southern Tier, uh, this is an incredible opportunity. Both dual enrollment and concurrent enrollment makes students more competitive. Um, it, it allows students to try out college coursework and it, it most likely guarantees that they'll continue their academic studies after high school. So we believe that this is a real game changer in terms of equity for students. Um, and this is, a, this is the outcome of a long-term partnership that um, is going to realize great rewards for students for a long, long time. We're in agreement on that, my friend. Um, our program is accredited by the uh, National Association of Concurrent Partnerships, NASIP. And so with that accreditation, that's a national accreditation, the quality of the courses are maintained. Um, it is definitely college coursework. And as Jim said, it is about access and equity. This tuition change, this policy change, um, allows the core mission of community colleges, which is access, um, to be broadened, to be expanded. We've had Certainly, geographic access is expanded in this partnership because it's right there in the high schools. Um, academic is expanded, academic access, because students, if they are in high school and can perform at the college level, they're allowed to take college coursework, and now financial access. So the, the core mission of access um, is expanded in every way in this um, continuing partnership um, and now this new tuition policy. We're hoping that it gives students the opportunity to try out some courses that they might not otherwise take um, so they can broaden their idea about post-secondary studies so that they can investigate other areas. Um, as most people know, um, sometimes there's a crunch for your academic studies, trying to fit the right coursework in at the right time. This alleviates some of that pressure and allows what I think all of our goal is to broaden students' perspectives mm -hmm. and their choices and their opportunities. Absolutely, and another thing that we're very proud about the fact is that this is also in alignment with what the New York State Legislature passed this year called the Every Student Succeeds Act, or ESSA, um, and we're one of the first community college partnerships with our local districts to enforce that and to bring that into fruition. And uh, it, again, it expanded, expands that access. You know, we've had presidential scholars in the tuition-free program here at SUNY CCC with the top 10% of graduating high school students can elect to come to SUNY CCC tuition-free. Governor Cuomo, two years ago, founded the Excelsior Scholarship which now allows um, families of an income of 125,000 or less, their students can elect to come to SUNY CCC tuition free, and now we have tuition free case. And it's just another one of our outstanding partnerships that we share. Corning Community College has been an outstanding partner for many, many years, uh, but I think we've really taken our partnership to a new level over the past few years with the additions of programs like uh, our new STEM Academy. Mm -hmm. um, and, and this certainly is really the icing on the cake for student equity. So we're very proud of this um, expansion of our partnership and we look forward to where we're gonna take it in the future. I'd like to thank uh, Dr. Douglas for, um, for her steadfast support of this 
and our own Commissioner Elia, Mary Ellen Elia, who's been an outstanding advocate for student equity uh, across New York State. Agreed. It's been a great partnership, and um, thank you, Jim, for all you've done, and we're looking forward to what we can do next. Thank you. Any questions from the press? Okay, we'll take each of you guys one at a time afterwards. Okay. Yeah.